One great thing about water taps is, no matter how big shot you are, it will make you go down. <laughs> you have to be humble in order to use the water tap, isn't it? First, <laughs> if you are an arrogant person, initial behavior will be like arrogant, but then you have to go down. Arrogant people will be like, <laughs> and there are water taps which will, which will rotate along the norm. Have you noticed? <laughs> Most of the public toilets are, you know, you go to the bus stop, you open it right and the entire tap turns right. <laughs> then you turn left, the entire turns left. And there are water taps which are completely relaxed. It will be slow, the same volume will come no matter how much you open it. <laughs> And you keep opening it for decades. You can keep opening because it has nothing to do. Yeah, definitely. You would have seen your grandfather. You know, for you, you like you like die out for hundred years. <laughs> and there are water taps. The more you try, sometimes you open it and then it will start flowing, isn't it? You don't know what to do. I mean, it's like oh, I shouldn't have touched it in the first place. Yeah. Now you try closing it. Have you noticed? The more you close, the forcer it comes. Yeah. <laughs> and then it keeps on coming, and especially in the neighbor's house, and you have to call the neighbor. And only that neighbor will know how to operate that water tap. <laughs> Five minutes will be the man, can you have come in here? She will be like, mm -hmm. some anti-lock breaking <laughs> You close it and then a little bit of like this and it will be okay. Like, how do you do it? <laughs> this is nothing, for ten years I have been using it. <laughs> Some water taps, the knob dances, have you noticed? Like this. <laughs> Sometimes you spend some time actually dancing with it. That, that, that knob the dances actually. I don't know for what joy. They're all happier, I think. All these non-living things are quite happier than the humans, I believe. Sometimes, yeah. <sighs> so that's about uh, you know all that happens. Or oh, don't ask me. Have you tried fixing the water tap? <laughs> Nothing like that, yeah? The most, when you're extremely happy, that's when the water tap actually flows out and whoosh! You'll be like, today I got a bonus, I'm gonna go home. <laughs> By 20, we water tap. <laughs> You'll be like, oh my god, you will close it first <laughs> with your hand. Is there someone? Nobody's at home, you're the only one. <laughs> there are only two options, you'll have to open it, put the tap inside, and then you, you know what happens also. You'll have tried this, yeah? Whoosh! <laughs> you throw it. <laughs> Except your hair, the entire body is wet. <laughs> and for some people, even the hair is wet, yeah? You don't know what to do. <laughs> you will do all that and <laughs> So that's about inside the house. But then when we go out, <laughs> we'll see a lot of public places where the tap will be on. Have you noticed? It will be flowing out of the bucket and all that. And you'll be like scolding the whole India. Ah, what is this? No, you know, nobody is responsible. You'll close it. I've done a great job. Next four days we'll talk about this for some ten people. You know what these people are? I closed it. Nobody cares. <laughs> there are a few water taps you will have to touch. If you touch it on the, the knob on the top, it will stop. The moment you remove your hand, it will start flowing, isn't it? I'm sure that most of you would have tried repairing it also, isn't it? Open the cap, there will be some rusted, one screw will be rusted. Now you want a screwdriver, you put some oil, you keep rotating after 5 minutes, you realize only the screwdriver is ready, yeah? <laughs> Not the screw, actually. <laughs> They're like, oh yeah, I think I made a mistake. 5 minutes, we're gone, gone for a task, yeah? And then, you know, you try all that. Now, you know, you close the water tank and you try repairing the water tank. Have you tried this? I'm sure that most of you would have tried at least once, yeah? So what you have to do now, at least for time being, you want to close that, you know, pipe. So what do we do? We'll have to, you know, go by and take some clothes. The first thing that you get is the old innerwear, isn't it? <laughs> the holes in it and all that, you will try and put it in. It doesn't work. And the problem is, you know, the you know, uh, hole is so big that the, the, that particular cloth will go completely inside. <laughs> and the worst part is, you can't remove it now. Yeah, why? <laughs> Only your finger can go inside. Yeah? <laughs> it is so big to touch. It. Only you can touch it. You will see like I'm able to touch it, but I'm not able to take it. <laughs> and the water tap is too small to put both the fingers inside, isn't it? <laughs> you gotta try putting it, and you try removing it, and then you need a screwdriver now to remove it. Yeah, you don't get a screwdriver. Where to get a screwdriver? Above the trunk, inside a cover, small pouch. Nothing but it. I'll take it from the neighbor. <laughs> Neighbor won't give you. Why? You never gave it to him. <laughs> it happens to me all the time. <laughs> like, he will say, I don't have a screwdriver. You know, inside you know, I'm 
know you are. <laughs> Somehow you get that screwdriver that you really wanted, and finally you you know you take it out, and there will be a cloth, then you will get some old uh, you know uh, dirty some bunion or something like that. You put it inside, and then you are ready. Yeah. <laughs> you say okay, it's just the time. <laughs> You'll be quite confident first five seconds. You should see what your mind says. It will hold. It will hold. It will hold. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> You know, just that five seconds after that, poof! <laughs> then your mind will say, I knew it! <laughs> How is that mind shift within five seconds? You knew it. And until then, you'll be like quite confident. No, no, it will hold. Then now the other things change. So now the only thing is you'll have to go and buy the water tap. You'll have to go now. Go, go to that shop. The worst thing is you'll have to walk to the shop. Why? Because it is too close to take a bike, <laughs> take a two-wheeler, too long to walk. Now it is like horrible, yeah? But you walk all the day. What happens in the hardware shop? You will say, sir, water pipe. You will ask, how many inches? Is this like suddenly, what is this out of syllabus question? <laughs> you can't go back and take the tab, you don't have the size. <laughs> sir, actually, generally, basically, it will be like, <laughs> tell me the inches, you will say. Sir, this much or... <laughs> I tried all this. <laughs> sir, this much sir, it will be. No, no, I need the pipe. Go get it. <laughs> so finally you will walk all the way and get the tap and then you know you get a solution and all that. Have you noticed that solution is so good in smell, yeah? Your right side of the brain, I don't know, right side and this is like the good part of your brain, you know. Bad part of your brain says hey, hey you know, just smell it once, smell it once. <laughs> then you say <take> cancer. <laughs> it will cause cancer, not supposed to smell. One last thing. <laughs> okay, so finally you put the tap and you put it all and what will happen to the tap? That thread will rotate exactly at one point it will stop and the tap will look upside down. <laughs> now what do you do if you if you rotate it down it will be loose. Now you don't know what to do. So finally you know it's a forget it, this is the tap and done with it. <laughs> you work or not, I don't care, but then that's all I can do from my thread. Being a plumber. <laughs> okay, so that is the whole idea that happens to us in the tap. This is all in the morning. What happens in the night for us? Yeah. <laughs> There'll be one tap which will keep you awake all night. <laughs> point, point, sir, sound. You, know? <laughs> you will be like, close the thing and put the pillow, and you will hear <laughs> whether that sound comes. Point. <laughs> It's like, go, I'll go, I'll close it now. <laughs> you will close it and you will wait. <laughs> it won't flow. But the time you take your eye off and the point it flows, at least, uh, it will be just a fraction of a second. You will say, oh, it didn't flow. <laughs> then you will go back. And so there are some days where you will happily open all the water taps <laughs> because there is no, uh, you know, uh, there is no water in the water tank. Have you noticed? You will open all the water taps. Happily, you will leave to office. <laughs> <laughs> then an irritating neighbor will call. Hey, who is having the key? <laughs> hey, the our entire you know, house is drowning, man. <laughs> Initially, you're like, no, it's not me. It's not my house. Did you check? Please, can you come? <laughs> then like an ambulance. <laughs> that because you're the only person who has the key for that. <laughs> There will be some 10 people standing around you, right? You're all angry. It looks like you're educated, works for bosses. You will not look at anybody, yeah? You will open and the entire house is like full of water. Some old, uh, you know, pen cap will be floating. Your wife's hairband will be floating. Even in that busy schedule, we would go, oh, that cap, that day I was actually looking for a television. 